And I think the gap is is there. Uh, that's why we're in Malaysia in 2016. We're still doing our best to, to help protect refugees uh, as, as best we can here. But we think now is a unique opportunity to start working more closely with government. And it's an opportunity to look at not what we've been doing in the past, but really to see how we can work more effectively together going forwards to deal with these quite complex and difficult issues. They need to have simply the security that they are not going to be arrested and they're not going to be exploited. If refugees can be registered and live here legally and show their faces in public and be proud of that, uh, we think that would be sufficient to really give them the protection they need. At the moment they're all treated as illegal migrants and that causes a great degree of suffering for people who are here. It's partly history. I think this has been a country that's hosted hundreds of thousands of refugees and many have moved on to other places and there is a reluctance to assume responsibility legal and practical for refugees and that's why UNHCR finds itself cast in this role uh, even today when we probably should be focusing more on real refugee situations in other places. The theme for this year is support refugees together. How do we do that together? Whether we're a government or a UN or a people, an ordinary society in a well-meaning and generous society like Malaysia, how do we do it more effectively together?